On the holiest day of the year, on Yom HaKippurim, as the day is waning, it's Mincha time. We're almost at the closing of the gates. We take out the Sefer Torah and we read a very unusual subject. We read the Parsha of Giloy Arayas, of not engaging in forbidden relationships. And Toysvis and Masech the Megillah is troubled. Why do we read about such an unusual subject on the holiest day of the year? Is this relevant to the Jewish people when we're in such a holy state? Toysvis says there's a hidden message in reading about this subject. We're messaging to HaKadosh Baruch Hu as follows. Hashem, you asked us not to be Megala Arayas, not to, so to speak, uncover illicit relations. The same way we shouldn't uncover Arayas. You too, Rebbein Shalom, don't uncover the scoop on us. Don't examine too carefully our record. Don't uncover our shame and perhaps embarrassing things we may have done. This is the message of reading the Parsha of Arayos on Yom Kippurim. And then it hit me that this movement that we're all trying to be involved in, Vayimain, exhibiting self-control in what we look at, this is sending HaKadosh Baruch Hu the most powerful possible message. This is sending HaKadosh Baruch Hu a request for the ultimate salvation, where we say to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, Hashem, just like you're asking of us, not to look at something shameful, not to look at something indecent, not to look at something bad, we then could ask you the same. Please deal with us measure for measure. Don't look at our shame. Don't look at our impropriety. Don't look at things that we have done bad. Is there any greater message telecasted to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, a message of hope, a message of salvation, a message of protection, then when we exhibit self-control in what we look at, we declare to HaKadosh Baruch Hu, we didn't look at something bad. Don't look too carefully at us. Don't examine us too carefully. Maybe you could overlook some things in our repertoire. This could be the greatest zechus for us when our fate hangs in the balance. What Hashem asks of us, we turn around and we're empowered to ask of Hashem. Don't look too carefully. What a powerful zechus on the Yoim Hadin. Wishing everyone Chasimah Toivah.